edition of Spotlight on the World brings us to Denmark. For years, the Danes have had a tolerant and casual attitude toward just about everything, from sex to drinking their beloved beer, even to casual speeding. There is a positive trend, but seven out of ten motorists are still pushing the limit. But now the Danes seem to have become less tolerant of speeding motorists, and they've come up with a rather innovative solution. Make way for the Speed Control Bikini Bandits. A specially trained team of enthusiastic young women not afraid to do whatever it takes so that motorists pay more attention to the speed limit. Sure, what we do is extreme, but I know from my heart what we are doing is working. People are slowing down, people are noticing. It's a fantastic idea. It's really kind of obvious. Why didn't they think of this sooner? What do you think about the Bikini Bandits? The Bikini Bandits! Denmark has redeemed itself! But the plan wasn't entirely foolproof. In the beginning, the Bikini Girls worked great. But let's just say it wasn't entirely thought through. One could argue that traffic in Copenhagen and much of Denmark has come to a total standstill, thus pushing the tolerance level of many Danes. I don't like them, and I know a lot of others that feel the same. I couldn't care less what anybody says. If people are slowing down, we've done our jobs, and since we're the world's best, we will continue to do our jobs. There you have it. Denmark Speed Control Bikini Bandits. Like them or not, now Danish speed limits are rarely ignored and nearly impossible to miss.